Hi, this video is a follow-up to our prior video of the importance of having a custom error page on your site. And what we're going to show you here is perhaps the easiest way. There are a number of ways to create a custom error page. This is the easiest one. What you have to do, most websites, 98% of them have a C panel that looks like this or a control panel. And in order to access it, you have to know the URL for the control panel, your username, and your password. And you can get those three pieces of information from your web designer. And um, once you do that, you can access it. Just scroll down here. This is it says error pages. Just click on that. And you'll see the most common error pages listed right here. Um, the 404 is the one that usually pops up the most time and you can customize each one of these. I wouldn't recommend that and what I would do is just customize one page for all of these. Now the way to set it up is you just click on each one of these and these are some options that would put stuff in the page. I wouldn't recommend that either and you can just type in your error page over here. I already had something typed in. Sorry you reached this page in error. Please visit our home page at and you can put that right in there. Then all you have to do is click Save and you're all set. Go on and do the same thing on the other error pages and that's it. You're finished. But this is really kind of plain vanilla. I wouldn't recommend that. I'd recommend something that looks so much better. So for that what we would do is you'd have to have an HTML editor and you can find one for free if you do a Google search or I would recommend you can get a Microsoft front page. Front page has been replaced um, by a, a new program so you can usually pick that up very inexpensively on eBay or um, other places on the web. So if you had that editor or anyone then you can go in and create a new page just like this you can use different type fonts and color and you can even put a graphic in and this is an animated graphic that we put in here and instead of just typing out the plain URL you could put it in as a hyperlink and make things really easy you click here or the actual topic of your page like we have over here then if you want you just go to the code view you look at the uh, code for the page and you just highlight the entire thing like that control C for copy. You go back to your um, control panel where you had that error page. Instead of putting in the plain vanilla one, you just put control V and you type your code in just like this. Go down to the bottom, write save. Click go back. And you can do the same thing for the next page just like that. Go back and just run down the list of all of these. And then when you're finished you'll have a really good looking custom error page. Now this is the way it actually came out on our site. Here you can see the animation and stuff when someone goes there. Now if they got this page in error and they click over here, over here, and over here it'll take them back on our site. So if they want to go to our home page, they would click that, and there they are right on our home page, which, by the way, is WebsiteTrafficBuilders.com. Now, here's the same thing we did for a real estate site. Uh, we didn't use any graphics on here, but we did list a lot more pages that are popular on the site. So besides the home page, we have the index page, which is different. We have a search the entire San Diego MLS. A various community real estate activity page, a free market evaluation, agent referral page, San Diego, California monthly events, uh, San Diego uh, real estate blog, etc. So these are the most popular pages on the site and we just made it very easy if somebody got the error message to just look over here real quick. Maybe they don't want to go back to the home page. They want one of these specific pages and by clicking on this it'll take them right back to it. Anyway, I, um, I hope you take a look at your site and make sure that you have a custom era page on your site similar to these. Appreciate your listing. Take care.